one called the last wheel trims, what? Ace wheel trims. Ace wheel trims, I think. Bloody hell. That puts the years on it. So when they're on, it looks like... Okay. Mm. Yeah, it's moved under its own steam. Off to the MOT station. Oh, there's no seat belt, is there? Brakes. So make sure the brakes do work. Work, huh? Yeah? Excellent. Well, it's a bit of agricultural, isn't it? It's no sinker mesh on second. <laughs> there we are. 20 quid to it. We'll have the roof down on the way up. Bit of fresh air. 2179. So off we go to Aberdeen. Oh, as far as we could get it. <laughs> well, you got the hang of the changing into second gear then. Fifteen miles an hour. What speed? Ooh, quite a change into third. What happens if we're on the winter uh, summer charge then? That's better. Yeah. Leave it to... Yeah, well, we'll just run it for a bit and stop. So that's doing... Nearly doing 30. <laughs> you seem to be wandering a bit across the road, <laughs> don't you? Why is that? <laughs> the steering is a bit weird, isn't it? Bloody right hell. I would stop if you and just have a look and make sure it's all okay. Definitely an A road to see though. 35? Yeah, 35. Yeah. Well, it's sounding alright at this speed, isn't it? 60, nearly 60 psi oil pressure and it's normal temperature. So what do you think then? It's alright. You know, your interpretation now with the an advanced driver, you know, driving this, your road test, top gear and first impression, brakes, it's tight, ah oh, well they haven't run in yet, performance, uh, yeah, no, that's good, gear change, now you got your turn, Ooh. I don't like leaning against that door, I do not like leaning against that door, Yeah, the traffic agent. Oh, well. Well, it's the first time this has been on the road since... 1998, it was, isn't it? 35 seems to be about its um, comfort of speed, doesn't it? Oh, you can see the kettle shaking, doesn't it? Oh. One side flop room, it looks as though the float uh, has got a bit of crap in it and there's petrol dripping out the car, so uh, it's good we stopped. Right, we're coming to um, Tredorman Hill in Astrid Manic, so this will be a test for it. Currently in four, that won't stay for in four here very long. It's started labour.
So you're fine in the uh, middle accelerator, okay? It'd be nice if we could adjust the ignition time in as well, mind. Go perhaps a bit better then. Yeah, you can go quite well in here. Yeah. Yeah, so we're uh, around the roundabout. Still pulling okay. Temperature is normal. Oil pressure is 50 psi. Going to the gauge, there's no petrol, but we've got the top on it. So that's the uh, float, we just bent the float uh, uh, lever down a bit, and uh, that seems to cure the fuel leak. We've got the top. Third. Third gear, yeah. Slowing down, it wouldn't accelerate anymore. Yeah. Horn work now. All right. Yeah. Well, we've made it to our day with one uh, little adjustment to the carburetor, and we've done 15 miles. Yeah. So uh, both had to drive a bit. The handling is um, certainly different. We're going to have some fish and chips because we're half an hour early for the MOT. And. Uh, the hang of that gearbox now, the synchromesh and everything, and the lack of it. Yeah. Here we are in Aberdeen. Just had some fish and chips in Reardon's. And the MOT station is just across the way. Well, that's sounding a bit quieter. That's with the traffic either. And in we go for the MOT. There it is. Off off on this MOT. So now we try to brake test. Just see what happens there. So there's the MOT certificate, and we're on the way back home. <laughs> so it's far. You said you say the brakes aren't the most efficient, do they? Uh, ooh, he's got that double D section going to a fine half now. Made the viaduct. How many miles? 30? 29, 29 miles. Oh. Might have come a via Double B clutch, speed the gearbox up. Yeah, I need to lose it. Turn the traffic gator off now. When the way that we go. Oh, it's like the Brad Monte Carlo rally, isn't it? Seven radar, sorry. Forty-five miles an hour. Feels like about a hundred. Mm. <laughs> Doesn't it? And off it goes with a little puff of smoke.